And that's where we begin our Disney story, with the first original Mickey Mouse. Mickey's story really begins in 1925, in this tiny garage in Hollywood, where Walt Disney created Mickey's ancestors, the nameless little mice that first appeared in his Alice cartoons. In this old film, a very young Walt Disney greets little Alice, who says, I would like to watch you draw some funnies. Walt invites her to see his latest cartoon, which features, surprisingly enough, a room full of animated mice. Three years later, Walt is desperately trying to come up with a new cartoon character. Here's Walt's own story of how it happened. I was in New York at the time. I'd been producing a series of pictures for a company there. They were about a rabbit called Oswald. But I lost that. They took it away from me, so I was all alone and had nothing. And Mrs. Disney and I were coming back from New York on the train. And I had to have something. I said, by the time I get to Hollywood, I must have something. To, uh, I can't tell them I've lost Oswald. So I, I had this mouse in the back of my head because a mouse is a sort of a sympathetic character in spite of the fact that everybody's frightened of a mouse, including myself. So Mickey Mouse was born, but he was not an overnight success. Then in 1928, the introduction of sound changed everything. Now, Mickey could have a full orchestra behind him when he made the first synchronized sound cartoon, Steamboat Willie. The recording musicians followed this crude beat pattern projected on the studio wall. Well, Steamboat Willie was a sensation. Mickey and his boss became front page news. Mickey Mouse Speaks. The whole world applauded when Mickey finally decided to say a few well-chosen words. Oh, I can't play. Play! Yes, ma'am. Mickey Mouse had now arrived. His great moment came in 1932, when all of Hollywood turned out to present Mickey with his first Academy Award. Here's Mickey and Minnie now. Followed by Pluto, Horace Horsecollar, and Clarabelle Cow. What a thrill for a little mouse to be congratulated by the biggest stars in Hollywood. Mickey was only four years old, the youngest star ever to receive an Oscar. His youthful bosses, Walt and his brother Roy, pose with their new protege. That garage where Mickey got his big break into show business is a long way from the Disney studio of today. I only hope that we never lose sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. 